I thought about trying my hand at the gauntlet just to see if I could do it. <laughs> Waste of time now. No one's stopping you. Or ice the vault dweller. <laughs> you can go. This belongs in the garbage can, yes? Our new boss. You're going to want to talk to Mags. Hey there. Well, I suppose we all owe you for putting down Coulter. Man was an idiot. Made us all look bad. <laughs> A clown stuck in his own little car. I guess we can take some solace in the fact that someone finally gave him what he deserved. I want to know, what did you feel as you did it? when you brought that walking pile of human garbage to his knees. What were you discussing when I walked in? Well, you, Overboss. You're an unknown quantity, and we're interested in knowing who we're dealing with. So we'd like if you answered the question. Yes. What went through you as you crushed the life out of that oaf? Regret, I guess. I didn't want to kill him. You'd be the only one. Agreed. Not going to make much of a splash around Nuka World with an attitude like that. Regardless, Gage's decree means that you're the new overboss. I suppose we can only hope you work out better than the last one. I'm Mags. This is my brother, William. Pleasure. Along with our co-conspirator, Lizzie, we run this crew. Call ourselves the Operators. You'll come to understand soon enough that we are the only gang you should be backing around here. Because we're the only ones who see this place for what it is. A temple. A testament to the only thing that matters in this world. And what's that? Caps. This place was built for the sole purpose of taking caps out of the pockets of fools. We only joined Gage and Coulter's little menagerie in order to restore it to that goal. Though, by somewhat more cutthroat methods than I expect its founders intended. Instead, Coulter had us sitting on our asses for the better part of a year while he lived large in his damn mountaintop. And that means, if you're going to be in charge around here, we'd like some assurances that you intend to bring this place back to its true purpose. And that we're going to get back to robbing folks of their fucking money. Right. And you want to explain to me why exactly I should be backing the operators? Because we dispense with the bullshit. My people aren't commanded by lunatic bloodlust or animal instincts. We are the only rational players around here, and would make valuable allies. So long as we know you intend to get this place back to bringing in caps. So we want to know what your plan is. Actually, I'm really more in this for the soda. Great. Another nut- William. Of course, overboss. So, you're welcome in the parlor whenever you like. 
Make yourself at home. And if you think you might be interested in running some jobs for us, you just come speak to me. But do take a little time to consider the kind of life we could all have if we put this place back to doing what it does best. Should be a couple odd jobs available if you want to get your hands dirty. Talk to Mags. We'd all considered putting a bullet in Coulter's back at some point. Suppose you just beat us to it. Overboss. Making, Making trouble? trouble? Good. Head on in, Overboss. Never did get why Coulter brought in three gangs to claim Nuka World. I mean, he had us. Don't need the rest. Not supposed to hurt the other gangs. No rule against tricking them into hurting each other. You're the new overboss, right? You sure made an example out of Colton. And you are... Impressed. I've never seen anyone surviving cola cars for more than a minute. Of course, you did have a little help. Gage was the one that clued you in. Yeah, I know all about it. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. I think Colter got exactly what he deserved. So you weren't loyal to Coulter? Hell no. Coulter was a goddamn idiot. With Coulter running the show, business was starting to dry up. Now that you're here, I'm betting everyone stands to make a lot more money. Speaking of which, I'm hoping you're here to spend a little bit of your own at the Nuka Cave. What exactly is this place? Ah, it's my pride and joy. The one good thing that came out of getting stuck working for Coulter. Yeah. All of the amusements and games around you are working thanks to yours truly. I'm the only one that can take them apart and put them back together again. If I go, then it's only a matter of time before they fall apart. And all the cute little prizes you can win? Yeah, you can thank me for those too. How do I get started? Eager to play, eh? <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Every game in the Nuka Kate still takes the original pre-war tokens. Just slot one into the machine and you're off. If your score is high enough, the machine will kick out a bunch of tickets, which you can redeem at a prize terminal for all sorts of goodies. How do I get tokens? Well, I usually just tell my customers that I sell them. But seeing as you're the new overboss, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to tell you a few other ways of getting them. You can also get tokens from the pre-war token machines in the Nuka Cave. But they only take pre-war money. And if you look around the parks hard enough, I'm betting you'll find a few here and there. I'll tell you what. Just to officially welcome you to Nuka World, here's a token to get you started. Sounds good. Thanks. No problem. I have to keep you coming back for more, right? Well, I guess that's it. If you need anything, you just let me know. Oh, don't forget to take this with you, boss. That way you can't say I never did you any favors. <laughs> The machines have been acting up, but don't worry, I fixed them. Yeah. 
Here to test out your skills, boss.
eager to absorb new data. I find this traveling agrees with me. Many a prize is still left in the redemption system. 